Hey Cancer, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your general reading for the week of November 5th through the 11th. So let's just jump right in and see what messages we get for you. All right, so we have the sun at the bottom of the deck. You could be dealing with a Leo. Um, I feel like there's an opportunity that you are getting ready to take. I feel like this week could be the beginning of an opportunity um, that you just accepted or it's like some offer. Um, you're really just ready to get it started. So I feel like you're going to be very happy with this decision. I feel like some of you could have recently accepted a new job opportunity, for example. Um, and this may be the first week that you start, right? Um, the fifth through the 11th could be that initial stage of this new chapter that you're beginning and i honestly feel like there's something very powerful about this new beginning because it feels like you're really starting to trust yourself or you're starting to really believe in yourself you know it feels like there's a lot of confidence to gain here and i feel like whatever position this is it's not only going to make you happy um on a circumstantial level but just personally right like it feels like there's more than one benefits like there's financial benefits right there's um, an increase in your abundance or your quality of life but then there's also this feeling of you know this is important to me as a person right as a um, as a human being i feel like there's something very balanced about this opportunity and i feel like you know even though it may be new it's something that you're going to be um, kind of getting the hang of quite fast so let's see if we can get some insight let's clarify the page of pentacles All right, death at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, I definitely feel like this is um, a new beginning that you have been anticipating and hoping for for a while. Maybe some of you recently uh, decided to leave a particular job, right? And maybe you didn't know exactly when you would find a new one. It feels like now you're ready to embrace um, your rebirth era. You're ready to embrace this new chapter. You're done with, you know, other um, things um, I also feel like the death could represent maybe that you're dealing with a Scorpio, but it's more like during Scorpio season, you're starting to transform in your own way. And so there's a very special theme there um, that I think you're, you know, resonating with for sure. It's almost like you're definitely a different version of yourself, but you're a more experienced version of yourself. And this opportunity that you're taking here really just proves that more and more. Uh, we have everything is fine, six of wands and the hermit. I feel like for some of you, it took some time to really um, visualize yourself in this position before saying, I'm going to go for it. Like maybe you had to really think about it. Um, think about all of the, you know, ways that this might change your life, right? Maybe the hermit is representing the fact that you had to do, um, you need, you needed to just really think about it. It wasn't something that you just jumped on immediately, right? You needed to um, really look at all of the details, but I feel like even though there maybe was some hesitation or doubt while you were thinking about this, I feel like the everything is fine card is here to represent the fact that even though something could be scary or daunting, um, that, that can be exciting, right? That could be a good thing when we know that we're about to do something very different, when, we're, when we know that we're about to embark on a new chapter, right? That brings about this feeling of, you know, my life is not going to change. Things are not, I mean, my life is not going to be the same. Things are changing. There's nothing stagnant about this situation. So I am transforming. It's like by default of this situation, Cancer, you are just a different type of person, right? Um, I feel like the Six of Wands is also representing the fact that there's success here. There's a lot of potential for you to thrive and grow um, and blossom in this situation. So I feel like this is really just about the fact that you made the right choice, um, and universe is just wanting to validate that and also reassure you that you are ready for it, that you are prepared um, and that this is not something um, that you will kind of struggle with, you know. So let's clarify the six of wands. The emperor at the bottom of the deck. I definitely feel like some of you could be taking on a leadership position or finding yourself in a leadership position. Maybe you are uh, for the first time working in a specific type of job that you haven't done before, but you're finally ready to put yourself to the test, right? You're ready to show off your skills and show off your ability. And I feel like that's really where you're going to see for yourself just how capable you are of managing this role. We have eight of pentacles, two of cups, four of pentacles. I feel like at the end of the day, um, if you are putting in the effort to do something, you're going to receive that back, right? So this is about kind of um, understanding that what you put in, you get out. 
I also feel like you could be connecting to a person as well. Like maybe a friend um, recommended you or maybe you, you know, are, you know, working somewhere where you also kind of have a relationship. And I feel like this could improve um, both situations, like being in this new position or maybe having that support system. It's only going to make it easier. And so if you already have that part of the equation figured out, all you have to do is just be consistent and keep putting in that effort and keep showing up, right? Four of Pentacles, maybe, you know, to some degree you worry about certain things, maybe financially. I feel like Universe is wanting to let you know as long as you are in control, there's no way that anything is going to, you know, kind of get out of your hands, right? Sometimes we worry uh, when we are in a good position that we're just somehow going to manage to lose it. And I feel like Universe is wanting to really keep you in that mindset that as long as you put in that work, you know, you have the control. And only you can take this opportunity away from yourself. So really, really hope you take it all in. And if you like this reading and it resonated, please give it a like, please subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.